hi friends I am back again in this video I am going to show you the defense formation of palace level 4 I already uploaded palace level 3 defense formation so this is the continuation of that video so in this video um, here we are going to see the formation strategy for the palace level 4 as you can see this is the palace level 4 and uh, I put it in the center of the base so here you can see in the same way we add, we put both our uh, guard posts beside the palace because uh, these guard posts are effective when it uh, when it's close to the palace and now i would like to bring these archer towers into close to the close to the palace closer to the palace because uh, Archers will also do a lot of damage at the beginning of uh, Bahubali the game levels. So archers will do a lot of damage and another thing is there that is catapult. As you can see here uh, it won't attack uh, within the red radius. It will attack uh, within the uh, white radius. So it will help us to counter the enemies who start attacking from outside the wall so uh, i suggest you to put closer to the palace this also in this level not in not in all the levels so next katapa katapa will also be close to the closer to the palace and uh, he is at level one and uh, i already uploaded katapa level two attack video so my next video would be on katapa level one um, this video also I will provide you uh, today and uh, this is this is the uh, closed uh, area of this palace and I am going to pack this uh, with uh, highest possible walls and uh, no need to bring anything into uh, the area of the palace within the compound wall so I, we are packing this to here There is a space inside so no need to worry we will close it also and uh, now i would like to uh, suggest you to put the wall in front of this uh, catapult area because as you all know catapult won't attack within this red radius if at all someone else attack from this side catapult won't do a lot of damage on them so that put a uh, double wall this side and uh, break this uh, we have no need to break it so bring this wall closer to this side and also bring this wall closer to this side we have one more stone here okay so uh, this is the wall formation so i am going to put this uh, spike trap here and uh, one cobra trap small cobra trap there i think uh, we have um, two more uh, items here and this cobra trap would be here whenever someone else attack uh, or guard post those will be um, affected with this cobra traps and spike traps okay and I would like to put one more thing into the area mm, let me think so we have to put our storage is also within the um, nearby the palace so I am removing this wall here I forgot I forgotten to put them and here one and this side it would be seems uh, pretty cool and we need some more space here yes so closing this area and this 
approach. Okay, we have to put one more thing into it. That should be our armory. Armory would be inside the compound bar. So, an embassy would be outside and bring these uh, four farms uh, closer to the palace. As you can see, our archer towers will cover these farms. That's why I am um, always uh, giving you this type of strategy here. And no need to worry about them. Our archers will look after those uh, farms and uh, removing that uh, bush and putting my gold mines this side. I think I achieved one uh, oh, two, two achievements. So I'm going to climb my river here. I just climbed the river, and uh, here I'm putting. Uh, our uh, gold mine and again no need to worry about that gold mine because uh, it is also covered by one archer tower and whatever we put it should be looks look like a, a beautiful uh, decoration so you can see uh, we almost done and uh, bringing these barracks this side there should be one 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 uh, tail gap between these barracks so that it seems pretty cool uh, when someone else uh, visit uh, our uh, base so i am going to remove this rock and this uh, okay uh, those will uh, seems a pretty cool design if, if at all I won't remove that and I'm bringing these barracks closure and putting this uh, camp uh, inside that bush so here also same now we can see the formation here this is an ASM formation and uh, uh, we don't need to bring these uh, builder huts closer to the palace if you want to bring put this uh, builder huts close to the palace put it here and one more thing put it here and uh, this is the formation of palace level 4 and uh, if at all uh, you don't want to give all 4 stars to the opponent you need uh, trophies were important so I would suggest you to put these guard posts opposite to this uh, base opposite to this palace so that whenever the enemy attacks this base it would take time to finish this base and the three minutes which we have to wage the war uh, against any player versus player base so that it will take uh, almost three minutes and uh, subsequently the war would be finished so uh, there will be no chance to destroy these uh, builder hut and this builder hut in order to get fourth star or third star so that is the strategy i would uh, suggest to you so this is the formation put this uh, embassy uh, closer to the catapult area and uh, as you can see here these catapult will do a lot of damage in beginning levels because uh, archers and warriors and thieves uh, these four these three are at the beginning levels they are very vulnerable at uh, attacks and uh, these catapults would definitely destroy the destroy kill uh, your enemy uh, so that you will definitely win defenses so this is the uh, awesome formation as far as i made and uh, if you if you like this video uh, hit the like button and uh, do comment on my videos and suggest your things also i would like to make more videos on uh, bahubali the game and more exciting stuff also coming soon and do subscribe to my channel and uh, share this video with your friends and family those who play the bahubali game and they will also learn the strategy to play this game and uh, once again i would like to thank you have a good day bye bye